this week on Reality Check. We are excited to bring you some fresh gist on what happened in the amazing world of television. From the Nigerian version of world's number one business reality show Lion's Den to the highlights for the just concluded celebration, a new season of Ready to Love and our very own Gulda Ultimate Search reality show. These and more on today's episode of Reality Check. But first, let's meet our commentators. Bali, Sarah, Debbie, and joining us as a special guest is Ultima Studios brings the lion's den to the Nigerian audience as entrepreneurs from different industries pitch their respective businesses for an investment of a lifetime from our five lions. Let's hear our reality check commentators' observations about this show. Nigeria, are you ready? to get front row seats, to wave upon wave of excitingly tense moments. You sound very intelligent, but you're not making intelligent decisions. Watch Nigeria's finest entrepreneurs pitch their businesses before five mega multi-millionaires. I'm probably raised more money over the last 15 years than any individual in this country. In hopes of getting an investment. I'll make you an offer. I'm out. Before you go into any business, you need to know what that business is all about. Me, I'm a hard-nosed businessman. I'm not a hard-nosed businesswoman. I'm sorry, I will be investing in this and I'm out. She only wanted 10 million Naira, guys! This is the first season for this one. For this yes, one yes. And apparently what, they're supposed to like uh, pitch ideas to exactly. uh, entrepreneurs, and potential investors and stuff. Yeah, and those are the ones investing in the idea. So if they don't like your idea, right then in the room, you're out. Yeah, no, I also that the, the investors are actually going to be fun. That's just the main thing. Who, this, pays, this like the last one, Who pays the investors to be there? The, the sponsors, sponsor? I guess. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, um, okay. yeah. I don't, I, this show is mostly the investors that create the show, right? Mm. Like, I know they are like counter similar kind of shows outside that they have like popular business guys that are investors. Really? Yeah. Well, my there's a couple of them. They have, there's a couple of them. But my own really is the structuring of the, um, should I say the after? I mean, it's good to put on the show, this and that. And that. What about after the show is over? Who what sends, happens to who the, send them? What happens to the winner? <laughs> no, Nobody I, cares. They, they would put money in their business. I know, now. but it's easy to say I will put money, but I would I love think for them be to. Really, no, exactly, yeah. I would love for them to really follow up on this thing. Right? Uh, I'm, I'm sure they do follow up. Uh, and, we've seen, and, we've seen, real, we've seen some shows where. Yeah, because before you say someone to come and pitch their own idea, you have to give them a reason to want to come and pitch their idea. Apart from you guys are going to give me money. What if you guys say the idea sucks and it doesn't suck, and then you go and invest in it behind me? That so was yeah, a day. There, there yeah. needs to be a contract. Yeah, definitely. I go there and so but Nigerians don't really respect contracts. Like I don't think that Nigeria is a place. No, where but these kind of guys, contract. come on. Like these kind of investors, it's, it's going to be bad guys. for them. Mm -hmm. Exactly. The, the the show itself. Exactly. It's like this. Yeah. When I, when you're investing money, you're not dashing the person money now. There's going to be collateral. Yeah. The well, person has to also give, give you something, something back. Well, basically, it has back. to be airtight. Like yeah, whatever whatever they're doing is not uh, you come in and just run away with money because this is there's a continuum continuum here. Yeah. Yeah, but I mean, as I'm, as business. I said, look, this show they care more about the show itself. It's, they what happens after show. is a show. Do you understand? The main thing is they want people to watch the show itself. Mm -hmm. Whatever you do after your business. That's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm hoping that yeah. there's some there's life after the show. But I like the idea though. Yeah, like, the idea. Unlike you guys, I've not seen any show like this. Before. I have. I have. Oh, there's I have, a million of them. I have. So I. But is this something you can do? Like televise you pitching your idea? I think. I think. I think. I think I can do it. It makes sense. Can you do it? Me? Yeah. Like, would you like to be televised pitching your idea to someone and hoping the person invests money in it? Nah. You won't want to do it, right? No. Yeah, same here. I, no, I think I can do it. I've done it. I, I definitely would. All right. Um. So welcome back. Welcome me back. <laughs> but yeah, welcome back to Reality Check for this week. Like Yay! you've already seen, Ooh. we have a special guest in the house. I'm not talking about this co-host that's like it's special. Wait, 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 <laughs> not this special. one. <laughs> not this one. Now see finish the closet. No Bally worries. Special. Now see finish the closet. Do you know where we went to go and bring him back from? He Bally. went on a journey, uh, you know, seven That seas, he came back from Abuja. Seven mountains. Back back, 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 back. <laughs> we have worry, somebody man. more important, yes, <laughs> to my haters. <laughs> <laughs> we have somebody very important with us right now. Superstar. 
Connoisseur. I got it right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Le, le. Yeah, there's one word that's missing. <laughs> Which one? Icon. Icon. Don't let them the call for you. The icons. Shut like, up. Those are where they always vex online. Eh? Oh, oh, Why they are like that? <laughs> Talk any <laughs> time now. Fears. We call for you. So yeah, we've got Lecon with us today. How you doing? I'm good. I'm great. Clearly, yeah, you look it's great. fun to be here. Okay, great. You're in for a great ride. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, of course, you know he's the president of the Icons, Fierce Nation, also reality star. <laughs> so, we need to find out what he's been up to since he left Big Brother Nigeria. I'm sure you know that reality show, I Am Lecon, but, you know, let's find out more about him. Lecon, what's going on? I'm good. They can walk one. You missed the opportunity. Sorry, sorry. You know? Eh? Rewind. They can walk one. They can walk one. I'm good. I'm fine. Since you stepped out of the Big Brother Nigeria house, you stepped onto another reality show. Yeah, yeah. Yours. I did. I did my reality yeah. show. Yeah, for so sure. So how was Max. the experience? I mean, yeah, that that was different. Okay. That was different because there were cameras different, following yeah. me around. Oh, okay. And it was more like life, yeah. right? You're yeah. outside, you're And you were already surrounded by other housemates. It was just nah, you controlling was just me, your own yeah. narrative. Yeah, exactly. So, how did that feel? so it was really work, really. It was a whole lot of work. Uh, the Go TV tour, the uh, different music uh, recordings. That, that was actually recording my project, then the Shall We Begin album. Oh, great. And some of the music videos of the same. Uh, project on uh, the show, it's, uh, like Great. Drunky Love, uh, Love so, and Light. So it was work, work, work. Yeah, on so it, was, it, was it a choice for it to be strictly work, work? More about I mean, that was that life. was immediately why I started. No, I'm saying whatever your personal life. Yeah, I mean, there were some um, discussions about uh, things that happened before I went into the show that I had to be cleared up. Okay. Yeah, but what yeah. was like your any relationship? No, any no relationship. It's just me hanging out with my friend. No romantic. I no mean, romantic yeah, out out. Uh, the the you know i had a girlfriend i had a relationship before i went on the show See, so I, had that I don't know that out. i had no idea i, I said, that. I said so did that. that so did that feature on i am yeah 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 it kind of oh, okay. yeah what we'll, happened we'll next i used to i used to with the babe no no but so i'm gonna watch how yeah yeah happened. going to watch oh, don't she agreed to appear on this no she didn't appear but whatever <laughs> that would have been okay. so cool actually. but how how was it how was it having cameras following your because were they, do you feel like there were times where Maybe you wanted to do something, but then because the camera... Yeah, I just came out, so it was new. It, it was, was new, new, right? I just came but out, I've, but it was I've, new, I've, so it was I've, new. That's my issue with a lot of Nigerian reality shows that try to do things like that. Yeah. It tends to... They, they tend to be so conscious of the camera, mm -hmm. whereby they're not able to be really themselves. give them reality. Yeah, I wasn't it, conscious, right? so what concerns me? Uh -huh. It was new <laughs> to me, but still I was... You are able to be yourself. I basically. was because it was... That's it. it was really work. So right. it was just the same. Just thing. But there's this content, this particular one of you going on a blind date. Yeah, I was so I was really disinterested. Idea? My brother did. I was really disinterested <laughs> Why? about the blind date. Because I wasn't in a, I mean we were on tour. We were in okay. Abuja. I were just what? Wait, we were in Abuja. Yeah, we were, we were going to fly to Enugu like the, the next day. And he said he had a surprise. I was really tired. And he said he had a surprise. Uh, she come downstairs and blah, blah, blah. And then oh. I have to get dressed. Because yeah. I was actually eating. And then when I got downstairs, like, the girl is actually fine, Sha. Yeah, she's so, very beautiful. Is she your type? Like, physically? Just... I mean... Who has a type anyway? I do have a type. 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 Yeah, but funny enough, what, the first thing that attracts you to a girl is the physical. Right. It's not but even then, the mental. Yeah, but then eventually. Yeah, if right, I can't yeah. come follow you, talk and you can't do yam bam. But yeah, yeah. But, but did she know that was she was fun. coming on a date with you? I, 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 no, she didn't. She didn't as well. I don't think she did. But it was fun. So, it was, was fun. The up to, up to oh, the, the point. Was over at this point. Which relationship? Oh, Yo, the one I had before. Yeah, yeah, yeah it was. It was. It was. Yeah, it was. So I was just chilling. I I was not in a oh, I want to make girls mood. No, yeah. but so it set this but up. Are you in it? I want to make girls mood now. I, uh, uh, see, I. What's your I, I mean, I don't ask. On behalf of the trust nation. <laughs> Come on. I mean, now. right now, I, I've, I've always been saying it. I'm not searching. I want to be found. Wow. So. I'm going to start using that I like line. that, I like that. Sarah, GPS so, signal. So, I mean, it's not even... <laughs> Lost. <Lost. laughs> <Lost. Lost. Lost. laughs> and... For, she's my friend now, by the way. Oh, We're friends. Oh, We're not... No, not, nothing else. So, really. she has your number? Yeah, she does. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> She's like, she has my number. So, so that was season one. Or yeah, is that's that season one. Off, or is there another season coming up? Yeah, there, there is. There's talks, actually. But obviously, it has to be right for me. It has to be right for the... Uh, right. Yeah, so 
we're still you know we spoke come. about what's it called reality shows nigerian reality shows recently and we're saying how real as nigerian reality yeah. shows because like he mentioned everyone is yeah yeah, yeah 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 so when mine was, was mine was because the director wasn't nigerian so there wasn't that there wasn't that oh this is how they do here this is how they do he just came to do his work the director flew in from south africa to yeah. create the show or was as real as possible because everything that happened there was there wasn't there was one time i was even talking and i said cut because i didn't want to i said cut and nobody oh, nobody answered me exactly. i mean you see how real i felt ill i felt ill on this show the, the illness wasn't public at that time, okay. but when people watched the show, they were like, oh, so this guy felt ill during this period. Wow. And so it was there, they were giving me injections there in front. I was shouting there. Ready? Eh? No, I'm not. Okay, should I go ahead? Go. Before you know it, it will be done. Hey! Don't shoot it. <laughs> ah, yeah, what you want? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you be that bad, I promise. Why you don't like this? I'm no, come and give me my bag. <laughs> <laughs> I want to shoot. Hey! I'm not I'm scared of I don't know why I'm scared of injection. I was never scared of injection like this. Let me just go ahead. Missy, come, come. Let me hold this. It wasn't that bad. What was it? That's so bad. <laughs> and so it's not like I would act. There are some things that I know that I will not act. I would just say it. Yeah. You know, so. so that means that means people can do reality shows, but then when they have a particular content they want to tell, like this is a guy who came out of a reality show and won. So there were a lot of things going on around him. Yes, so it was easier to make yeah, a reality yeah, it was show easy. Yeah. So, than, yeah. than to just create yeah. scenarios. Yeah. 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 Exactly. I feel like my life is much more fun now because now I'm much more. I've adjusted more. Yeah. And like, there's a lot of things I'm not really bothered about anymore. Yeah. Right. I was when I first came out. I was really right. conscious about a lot of things. But right now I'm like in a chilled space. Yeah. You, you've absorbed yourself. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Now, so, yeah, Abby. I, I, like, <laughs> I the, am. If, if the sister. season two actually does come out, I believe it's going to be much more fun than the season. Fingers one. crossed. Yeah. I am like. Yeah. 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 It's awesome. Celebration 2021 has come and gone. But the memories will always linger on in the minds of all and sundry. The annual festival of music and arts in honor of the life and times of Nigeria's foremost music icon, the late Fela and Nicola Kukuti, featured different performances by artists all across the world. Now, for the benefit of those who missed out on this year's celebration, our commentators are on the standby to break it down for y'all. What if there was a reality show, like Keeping Up with the Cooties or something? I'll like watch. How, how mad would that be? I will watch. Because I yeah, have I mean, personality out of that. Yeah, I, 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 think, I think there's a couple of them that have great personality. She yeah. always is. We, we well, give well, content for days. Right. That's content money. for days. Yeah. So, yes. so, Even Yeni and Show Cootie, please. Think about it. Yeah, I think that would be cool. I think that would be cool. Were you at Collaboration? No, I was supposed to be, but I had a late flight. I, had, I was in Abuja, so oh. I was supposed to actually perform on the final day, but my flight. Oh. Yeah. But you, yes. did you perform on the last one? Have you performed on any one before? Last, no, I've, last I've never performed oh, you've never that celebration. Yeah. Nah. Oh, okay. Next year, definitely. Yeah. Next year. Yeah. Make that late next year. Make that happen. Do you have like a favorite Pella song? Yeah, the, the one that J. Cole sampled. Uh, which one was that? Uh, J. Cole sampled one for Bonson for Let Nas Down. So that saxophone that you hear in J. Cole's mm. song like Nas Down and you were hearing me bro. Mm. That was Fella's voice saying me bro. I think that's uh when trouble go sleep voila uh, you go find yeah well, well at the well, intro well. there was like a an, an interlude before yeah, the song where, started where, where says, it was just soloing so it was saying me bro me bro dada and that was what J. Cole sampled right. on uh let Nas Down. So that's my favorite because it was. Guys, don't sample for that tire. Or... Yeah, yeah, it's what. It's, what? It's, what? It's, I think it's also one of the most sampled. Most sampled artists. artists. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I think Absolutely. Jay Z. Jay Z sampled him too. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 And me too. I will sample him soon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just putting it out there. So you know, I sample. 
<laughs> and then I, li I, I like I like Made. Yeah, I met oh. with, I met with him. Uh, I think on the finale of the Big Brother. Oh, okay. Yeah, he performed and I performed too. Okay. So I met with him there. Yeah. I think I, he's, he's a a I know this, I know yeah. him, but I don't think I know any of you his songs. Yeah, I don't know any yeah. of his songs. And then his dad. Femi Femi. Yeah, he, he. I think he has a record. He held the longest notes. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not sure if he broke the record, but because no, I'm think... hearing 45 minutes, uh, yeah. and he did 46 minutes. Yeah, he did. What? So yeah, he held the notes. But there's yeah, a particular technique. Notes for 46 minutes. So there's a particular technique that he used. So in that particular category of that technique. Yeah. Because yeah. it became controversial because mm. someone was like. No, no, no. There's someone else holding that with a longer period. Yeah. So I think it was a particular. I still technique. Kenny G. Well, I think uh, I was reading one that it came up short 20 minutes or something. But the day he did that, my Maddy was beside him. Because mm. he once he did, he just left and he, my day continued playing. Wow. I admire I admire them. Yeah. I admire the kind of music they create because it's so powerful. In the sense that you don't really... You can tell that there's something driving it other than I just want to create music. Yeah, yeah, true. Yeah, yeah there's, true. A, there's something under the Yes, yeah. there's something driving yeah. it. I think I'm going to add this thing to my bucket list. These girls that do backup for them and dress this way. Uh, I'll just like to be in their lives, like in their <laughs> shoes, but just maybe just one See day. See why we need a real life. Maybe, like maybe when, I sam <laughs> when I sample, you come and do something. I'll come and do it. I'll be yeah. and dance for a Just yeah. dress yeah. like this and just, I would <laughs> just like but to. But I just want to give kudos to Femi because it's not easy carrying that torch, you know, being yeah. the son of yeah. such a legendary person. Yeah. And I like the fact that, you know, Fela was like, you know, waxing 45 minute record, one hour record. But Femi came in and broke it down for a lot of us to enjoy in short, short form. Versions. Yeah, see, this, he Four does minutes, this every time. Six when minutes, he's done, consume your he appropriate. leaves Madi and Madi just finishes yeah. up. You know, they yeah. started like that when he was younger. Like, he used to come on stage with him, Madi. Oh, really? really? Yeah. Like, Madi has been on stage since he was a toddler. Like, wow. he just wow. come in, vibe. And then he started playing some instruments. So basically, the mantle is on him. Maddy grew up on stage with Yeah, yeah definitely. And he's wow. going to do wonders. He's going to, uh, trust me, he's going this to do a lot of great things. I feel like, ma, the kind of things that I'm seeing for him, man, it's not here. Mm. And everybody's going to is be wild. Yeah. Yes, now, yes. They're completely and then, look at and then this, people always think. The only thing would be like, will the personality match up? I, I, I don't no, know, but I do yeah. know. It's going to see. To I feel that. like I feel like he's going to be a wonderful and a great superstar, and he's going to break boundaries that both his granddad and his yeah. Dad. I mean, one yeah, thing I don't, one, one thing is if, if, well. you, if you keep saying now to compare, mm -hmm. it's going to be first of all nobody can be as good. Fella, yeah. like you can't feel those shoes. Yeah, you can't. You have to create get your own shoes, yeah. right? You can't try. To yeah, and what he's doing is so, way way different. Yeah, because it's not because it's like a different vibe. Exactly. Well, you can't escape the comparison, Sha. Yeah, people yeah, will always it'll, compare. It'll probably, but then, probably should, but will, then but woo, at the end if of you are day, comparing, man. you are wasting your time last exactly. last because the times are different. Yeah, what exactly. Is, what uh, what Fela was singing about was different, different from what this guy yeah, singing yeah, about. Yeah, so, it's a different reality. Exactly. But yeah, like, nah, nah, nah. Leave good. the comparisons alone. I'm actually pretty, pretty pained. That that you pain pain. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's a mad crowd to perform yeah. to. Yeah. Trust me. And it's my people, I'm... my mainland people. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All I found they stay mainland. <laughs> I'm not, I don't even, but uh, they're my people. <laughs> <laughs> the Ready to Love reality show is back with another season. 20 new men and women who are dripping in swag and sexiness will be engaging one another as they get to open up their hearts in readiness for real romance. Taking the quest for love to a whole new level. I'm sure our commentators can tell us more. You can't have your cake and eat too. And that. it's not, it's I'm not, and I'm not gonna stay there for that. The conversations I'm having with him, he's telling me that I'm the main one. lie about different things to different women. I'm just, I'm done. Why, no, that why, means that why, you're why not people... ready. It's called ready to love, not confused as <laughs> That sounds very hater-ish. The thing got real. Don't, don't ever try me. I'm not Nobody. doing it. Third time Yo. homegirl said hater-ish. Ain't no Whoa. hater in me. People I don't like are It pisses me off. Well, me and the guys have talked. During this process, you haven't taken the time to get to know a lot of the fellas. You showed your whole true colors this mother weekend. Approach each moment like it owes you something. I really care about you. I haven't really met anyone to make me feel like. 
20 guys and 20 girls. So 40. No, no, no. 20 men and women, I think, all together. So 10, 10. Yeah. yeah. Ah, what are they looking for? Allah. Allah love. Allah Everybody's looking for love. No, no. So these are just random people, not that they're couples or anything. No, I think they are just. So they meet themselves there knowing that, oh, you gotta hook up with somebody. Yeah, you that's have to why fall you in love. That's why you can't. No, not but just how do you come. know I'm not faking? That's why love. they say ready to love. So you <laughs> have to come with oh, so yeah, so they're ready, they're How ready do you to know love. you win? How do who wins? Whoever has the best chemistry, I guess, you know. How do you judge it? chemistry? They determine I mean, it. They, the producers, I believe. For... Everyone wants to be loved and to love. But at the end of the day, it doesn't really happen on a dating show. No. That's what I believe. Um, no, but I think it does. Sometimes. Few times. Few times. Few times. Few times it does. Compared to the number of dating love, love, reality love. shows we have, as in, they are too few. Would you like go for a show that has to do with finding love, finding romance? Strictly. No, I'm not looking for love now. So you never, no. never? No. no. No matter how attractive it might seem to you at that time. No. 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 I mean, if it's... Honestly, right now, it's two things for me. If it's not my music or it's not money. You're not yeah. interested. Wow. <laughs> I mean, it's not a bad thing to be interested in love. I'm not yeah. it, just be, be sincere with yourself. Because here, right here, here, I don't think you're going to find what you're looking for. Depending yeah, on what you're I'll, looking I'll, for. I'll never go to a reality show to find love. I'm not saying I won't go to a love reality show because okay. I might go there to find something else. <laughs> but definitely, definitely not love. Now, if you are a fan of adventurous reality shows, the Goulder Ultimate Search is back with the 12th season. 16 contestants got the final ticket, but only one will be able to stand out as the ultimate winner at the end of the search. Is anything different about this new season of Gus? Well, hey, let's stick a ride with our commentators on this one. <laughs> you know, I actually thought that the Taskmasters were always the hosts for the event, yeah. for the show, yeah. because we see people like Chi Di Mukeme, Bob Manuel, Genevieve, when she did the celebrity, celebrity edition, version, yeah. they were the task. Was Genevieve masters. with them when she did? Was she with them? She was on, the host. On the, yeah, yeah, she was in there. She, she was in there. Yes, she was with them. Was. That's still the best season for yeah. Good Art Me you know, see these things there, uh, this thing where they are doing some nonsense workouts and they are sweating and crying and shaking. I feel this I really hate this show. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just never like back um, then people would stay away uh, by 10 p.m. to uh, watch Ultimate Search and it never made sense to me. It's like, why are you watching for suffering? They're carrying so torch, they're looking for something, do, climbing do like, trees, do like doing Yeah, but that's it now. Do like camping. I when it's fun, not when I'm going to suffer. But if Well that's like, kind that's kind but of that's idea. Is, Sometimes, yeah. uh, okay, there's this one that's kind of for idea. life. Like, there was, exactly. a, there was they fell a tree, okay. they fell a tree, right? And it was like um, covering like a stream or something. Mm -hmm. And they had to climb that tree. Like, you don't have, you won't hold anything. Mm -hmm. You just have to put your, you just have to walk and balance. No, yeah. yeah. And people were falling inside the water. And people, that is a fun people were part enjoying it. Like, yes. It's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, that's it's like, a fun it's part of it. Tree. If you're going to NYSC camp, there are some routines. You know, I never did all of that. Exactly. Like, at NYSC camp, what they call him, is you drill know that you want to be dancing for a fella at this time. That's what I like. You see all those things in NYSC. I didn't try it. Because I was like, hell no. Why? I, those things make me upset. Like, yeah, why but that's do I, fine. You, why you, do I have to do this? That's fine with you not doing this, but you, watching other people do it, I, it's I fun. I wasn't even watching Watching other people fall, it's fun. <laughs> watching other people suffer, it's fun. <laughs> Trust me. So, obviously, there are requirements. You're required to be fit and be able to swim. Now, it's the swimming part that usually gets so me. Right, take a look at this. Look at this. Look at this. So, this one. I think what? <laughs> This one, I think this one was the one that said, there was one that said, I was waiting for the water to accommodate me. I said, you be mommy water? Why is water accommodating you? There was one that said, literally said, don't worry, I'm going to finish. I should visit you. I'm going to finish. I won't finish. <laughs> and they ask all these people these questions before they, they come. They will ask you, can, can, you, you, can you swim? Can you do? They will say there yes. There was one guy that literally said, I was on YouTube watching tutorials. On how to swim. I wanted to die. <laughs> My job. Who does oh that? Oh my god. But how many lifeguards do they have around? They should yeah, have they, they, they would have a lot. Because sure this one would. now, immediately she was doing a wobbly thing. They pulled Somebody her out. Pulled yeah. out. <laughs> but you know what? You know probably what? do. But you know, this is coming very, very, uh, you know, at an interesting moment, especially when that um, Netflix show is, is trending. Squid, Squid Game! Game. <laughs> now imagine <laughs> that they have that format. <laughs> And the guys literally say you have to. Mm. You are eliminated. Mm. <laughs> 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 
Oh, yeah, allow you, you to browse. You should like, watch Squid Game if you want, <laughs> so that you understand. No, no, no. Or, or your first day, your first day, you're in camp and you hear Mugu Waka. <laughs> you're like, have you seen Squid Game? <laughs> you're like, yeah, me, yeah, like, <laughs> silly. I might just. I'll just, I'll just cry and pee on myself. I'll just I die see. like that. I'll be crying I think everybody, I think die. everybody in the game, they are bad people, Sha. I think everybody in the game, in the movie, they are yeah. bad people, including the the supposed protagonist. He's so also, a, so, he's also so a so wicked they call, person. So let, they call, let's say that the show is like hundred million dollars and eliminate. I mean, yeah, win you have to or kill so if you if somebody has die. to die for you to get money, you're a bad person now. Okay, so you wouldn't do it. No, like I wouldn't. That. I wouldn't now. If somebody has. If somebody's going dollars. to. We are going to, to compete, Abby, mm -hmm. and then people who do not win will die. Yeah. Then that you're a bad person. Okay, so yeah. So, but thankfully, good ultimate search is not, not like that. Game. Yeah, no. it's not though. You won't hear Muguwa. <laughs> <laughs> Even but I'm so actually it. looking for I, that I know it's it's nice. <laughs> for real? That thing is if nice. I hear it, I know. And then when you watch it. it in English so that, uh, in English language, yeah, yeah. it's language. not fun. It's not fun. Watch it in English. Mm. Yeah. Did you watch it in English? I watched it in English. Uh, and that's the first time I'm ever watching a show in English. No, you have to watch it over. Like for each show. Yeah. Both for each show I watch, I watch in the normal language. Watch it in your language. Please, if you are a reality show organizer, do not try that. Squid Game is not for you. I think they're actually trying it in some in in a country. Yeah, but not the die part. But no, but no. They're even doing in Abuja here. <laughs> Squid Game Abuja. That's great. But of course, they are not killing anyone. <laughs> I think I think they are psychopaths that can come up Let with it. Trust me. All right, guys, that's our show for this week. Now, don't forget, please, to tune in next week when we bring you more on Reality Check. 